Welcome back. Are you ready to make a kite with me? All right, well, for this project, you're going to need the following things. You're going to need a piece of paper and you're going to need a ruler, a piece of string, a piece of tape, something to draw with, scissors, and then you should be all set. Now, for this activity, I'm gonna play some music for us to listen to, and I decided to play a blue whale song, since that's the animal that I decided to paint on my guitar that we made earlier in the week. All right, so for this project, you're gonna choose what paper you want. I chose the piece of art that we made yesterday when we, after we read paint on um, playing from the heart, we made, we made artwork from our hearts. And you're gonna take your ruler and basically what we're doing is we're gonna make a diamond shape. And you're gonna put it here and draw a line. I'm gonna choose a different marker that works a little bit better. Alright. Let's try one more time, because if the first time you don't succeed, the second time doesn't work, we just try again. We don't give up. Ah, see? It worked that time. And then you're gonna do the same thing to oh, the other side. And if you need help for this project, do not be afraid to ask for help. I'm sure there's someone around that can help you. We're gonna do the same thing on the top. And then once we have our diamond, you're going to get your scissors and you're gonna cut it out. And you're just gonna follow the lines. And open, shut, open, shut, open, shut, open, shut, open, shut, open, shut until you reach the point. I'm just gonna speed it along so we can get to our next step. One more time. Now we have, voila, a diamond shape. What I want you to do before we finish the kite is I want you to draw your favorite instrument on the diamond. I'm gonna draw a ukulele, because a ukulele is my favorite instrument. And so what I just drew first was kind of, you know, it reminds me of a peanut. Doesn't it look like a peanut? And then I'm gonna draw a vertical line up, then a horizontal line, and then come back down again. And that's gonna be the handle. So I'll give you a closer look. And I'm gonna draw some half circles on both sides for the knobs. And I'm gonna draw an oval shape for the hole that's in the guitar. And then before I show you, I'm gonna draw the strings, which are just gonna be long vertical lines. All right. 
that's my ukulele. And later on, I'll fill in the rest of the details. But for the interest of time, let's finish. So, now you're gonna take your string and you're gonna tape it onto the back, just like that. And then you have your very own kite. And you are more than welcome to be as creative, as, creative and imaginative as you would like. If you wanna add more decorations to your kite, go for it. Uh, but please make sure that you do draw whatever your favorite instrument is. And if it, you think it's hard, of like how do I draw it? Look at a, pic, a picture of it and study. What kind of lines does it have? What kind of shapes do you see? And just try your best. Take it one step at a time. Uh, so that's all for today, my friends. I had so much fun reading Gilberto and the wind, talking about the vibration and sound and pitch and volume with you and doing science experiments with you. And I can't wait to see you all tomorrow. Bye for now.